Hey dolls! So today's video is going to be focused on a thrift store haul. I went to Goodwill today as you can see. I only spent $20. I told myself that I was going to be spending no more than $20 so I think my total was like $17.94. So I didn't even spend a full $20 but I figured that I would just do a little $20 thrift haul for you guys today and I did just get back from going out so my hair is in this crazy little bun my roots are getting bad again so I need to touch those up and I kind of look a hot mess today so bear with me <laughs> So the first thing I got is this pink binder right here. It was 99 cents and I get these binders for when I get letters from you guys and I stuff these things as full as they can get and then I keep them all in a super safe place so when I'm feeling down or something I can just go back and read all the nice lovely letters that you guys send me. I usually get these at the thrift store because I just fill them up so super quick I don't see the point in spending five to seven dollars on one just in itself nine times out of ten they are in really really good shape I can find some that are in really good condition so if you're looking for binders for school or something definitely check out thrift stores because they're very inexpensive there and nine times out of ten you can find some really good ones okay and then moving on to the clothing items I only got a few things I got these pair of shorts right here. Um, these are the brand Love Culture jeans. I had probably seven or eight different pair of shorts and jeans that I wanted to try on. Um, so I went ahead and tried everything on and I ended up only getting two out of the like seven that I tried on. So that's why I always stress try things on first before you spend the money. Because with thrift stores you can't necessarily take things back. So these are very cute and these were $2.99 so $3 shorts can't complain. And then these jeans right here are actually Aeropostale or Aeropastel however you guys pronounce those and these are um these were five dollars but these are really awesome because I'm really short so I have to have like short length jeans and I tried these on and they fit absolutely perfect I'm excited to pair these with my boots that I have and everything because they are kind of the boot cut style and they are in amazing shape no holes no rips no stains no tears no nothing so another awesome find I needed a new pair of jeans and I was so happy that I found these and then I got this adorable nightie. This was $2.99 and it's got roses all over it and this is the brand Jenny by Jennifer Moore and it is the Intimates and it's so like soft and just it feels really nice. It's like a really soft cotton and uh, it's stretchy as well so that's nice but this is going to be super cute. I love how the bottom has like this little ruffle and it's just so pink and roses and just really cute so I was happy that I found this as well. For the last clothing item I got this I actually found in the little girl section. It's a size large but it is stretchy and it is such a cute little like it's like a tube top dress but this part right here is really stretchy. I didn't actually get to try this one on but I'm 90% sure that it'll probably fit. But I just love the like rose print on it and this bottom is all like poofy and it's so cute. I don't know if you guys can see the whole thing but it's going to be so cute over swimsuits and stuff during the summer if I just want to throw something on but still be super cute when I go out. And it's adorable. I think at one point it did come with a belt because it does have some belt loops on it. Which is great because I have some black belts that um, I can kind of pair with this or different colored belts as well. And I can pair it with it that I already have. And this was only $5. There's no rips, there's no tears, there's nothing. It looks practically brand new. So this was another awesome steal. And again, I found that in a little girl section. So always, 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 whenever you're going to thrift stores or yard sales or wherever, just look around. It doesn't matter if you go, if you're a size small, venture over to the extra large section because you might be able to find some clothes that are like stuck there and they may end up fitting you. And, you know, just play, play with different sizes and look around in all different sections because chances are you could find something really, really, really good. And the very last thing that I got was just this little tiny bunny. It's just a little figurine, but I thought she was super adorable and they charged me like 99 cents for this. But um, I just thought she was so cute to, you know, put in my room for the Easter weekend or whatever. Um, and she does have little posable legs and stuff and 
she's just so cute. I love it so much. She's just so precious. So I had to get her because she just went with the theme of my room really well with all the pastels. So yeah, I spent under $20, and that is an awesome deal considering a pair of Aeropostale jeans are how much? Like, I don't even shop there, so I don't even know how much their jeans are, but I know that their jeans aren't usually $5. So, and this dress alone would probably be like $20 somewhere. I don't know the brand on this. Let me find it. I forgot to tell you guys. Oh, the brand on this is Annabelle. So, in case you guys were curious about that. But yeah, that is everything that I got at Goodwill for today, and I figured I would share it with all of you guys. Definitely don't be afraid to go check out local thrift stores and stuff. Just always, always, always remember to wash the items when you get them home before you wear them, just in case you don't want to transfer head slice or anything like that, because a majority of the thrift stores do not wash them before they put them out on the floor. So please just keep that in mind. Be safe about it. Venture around and look in all different sections that you can. Take your time and dig through cardboard boxes and the Tupperware boxes and dig through all the shelves and you never know what you could find. I mean, I found this Victoria's Secret hoodie at a thrift store at Bellevue Village for like two or three dollars. So you never know what you can find. But anyway, with that being said, I am going to go ahead and let you guys go. I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below what your best find was at a thrift store. And with that being said, I will talk to you guys in my next video. So until then, so long, stay strong, stay true, and be you. Right. Bye!